Hello, praise the Lord. Welcome to the transformative world of daily dose of God's word with Pastor Cherry Sean. Get ready to embark on a journey where the power of God's word meets your life challenges. In this podcast, Pastor Cherry will delve into a profound teaching of faith, motivation, and practical application of biblical wisdom. Be inspired as you listen. Hey, praise the Lord. Shalom family. I welcome you to Daily Dose of God's Word this morning. I welcome you to this new week. As you start this new week, remember to pray because nothing can take the place of prayer in your life because prayer is unique. Prayer has its own value in each one of our lives. Just like how oxygen cannot have a substitute, you know, with any other gas, I would want you to know prayer doesn't have any substitute in your life life. My desire for you is not just to give you information through this podcast, but to inspire you to have a hunger for God. My heart is really burdened to pray. My heart is really burdened to see a group a generation of believers would rise up to pray because prayer gets the attention of God. As I say this, I'm reminded of an incident that happened in the Bible. In the book of Acts chapter 9 verse 11, it says, The Lord said, Go over to Straight Street to the house of Judas. When you get there, ask for a man from Tarsus named Saul. He is praying to me right now. You know, God is giving an instruction to Ananias so that he could go and lay his hands on this man by name Saul because he was encountered by the Lord on the way to Damascus and he heard the voice of God and he was blinded you know his eyes were blind and for three days he didn't eat anything you know his physical vision was blinded and he is now in a place where he needs God to come and intervene in his life and for God to intervene in his life he needed Ananias he sent Ananias for for his healing. You know, sometimes even in our life, you know, when we are praying for a breakthrough, God doesn't necessarily tear the heaven down for you and come down so that, you know, you could receive your healing or you could receive your breakthrough. He sends people. And during that phase, how you respond, how you behave, how you rally in prayer is something that you need to really understand. Because he heard the voice of God. Saul heard the voice of God. Saul encountered God, you know, but he still didn't stop praying you know while he is praying Jesus is mentioning Ananias that he is praying to me right now because prayer gets the attention of God he got the attention of God and this attention changed Ananias direction to Saul that is what prayer can do when you begin to pray you are getting the attention of God remember this you know prayer is not something that you know you do it on a ritual basis prayer is not a form of tradition or you know something that is based out of religion. Prayer is something that is based out of an encounter a relationship that you share with God. This morning as you start this day, I would want to encourage you. I would want to provoke you. I would want to challenge you to pray because your prayer gets the attention of God. May God bless you. I will see you tomorrow. Have a blessed, blessed day. God bless you. As we conclude another empowering episode of Daily Dose of God's Word with Pastor Cherry Sean, remember that your journey towards a transformed life has just begun. To know more about us, check out our social media handles. Thank you.